Hello there, truth seekers. This is your boy, Ben, back with some piping hot tea on the Sussex squad's disastrous Valentine's date night. Reports are coming in that Harry and Meghan got into a big blowout fight during dinner, and no amount of fake PDA could cover up the tension. I'm telling you, these two are unhappily ever after. Now, I know you guys are excited to hear more about this, but before we move on, I'd like to thank you for your support. And if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, guys, what are you waiting for? Subscribe now. So, here we go, guys. According to some serious reports, it has been seen that Harry and Meghan went to some fancy restaurant in Vancouver for V-Day while visiting for the Invictus Games. As usual, Meghan was dressed to the nines in an attention-grabbing outfit. Got to play up for the cameras, but multiple witnesses claim the Sussexes were miserable for the whole dinner. Despite the report saying they were all smiles and touching, it was apparently all for show. Behind the scenes, Harry was sulking and Meghan was her domineering self. One insider described it as a disaster Valentine's dinner, with Meghan and Harry fighting the entire time. Yikes. Nothing says happy Valentine's Day like bickering with your spouse. And can we talk about how ridiculous Meghan looked? The gaudy red ensemble with black pants and heels. She looked like a clown. Witnesses said she resembled the Joker. How fitting. No wonder Harry was in a bad mood. He probably so tired of Meghan's over-the-top outfits and her bossiness. Don't forget, Meghan runs the relationship. Harry's just a puppet on a leash. This is what happens when you marry a narcissistic social climber like Meghan. Utter misery. Harry looks depressed in every photo these days while Meghan clings to him to feed her ego. There's no love, only dysfunction. And using the back entrance of the restaurant screams diva behavior. Who do they think they are? Meghan loves to act like an A-lister. It's embarrassing. No wonder the actual celebrities in Vancouver steer clear of her circus. If their marriage was actually strong, they wouldn't need these stunts. The hand-holding, the moony eyes, it's all fake for the cameras. Behind closed doors, I'm sure they fight constantly. Meghan won't let Harry have an opinion. Let this disaster V-Day be a lesson to Harry. It's time to walk away. Meghan will never change. She'll keep mistreating him while chasing fame and fortune. The spiteful marriage helps no one. Have some self-respect and ditch the succubus, Harry. Wow. Harry, go back to your loving family in the UK. Meghan belongs in LA with all the other narcissists. Don't let her drag you down further. But sadly, I think that whipped Harry is too far gone under Meghan's manipulative spell. He threw away his entire life for her. There's no going back now. What a tragic waste for someone who was once filled with potential. In summary, Harry and Meghan's romantic Valentine's blowout comes as no surprise. Their fake PR relationship is on the rocks. Maybe they don't marry actresses looking for fame next time. Lesson learned. What do you guys think? Are Meghan and Harry headed for Splitsville? Let me know in the comments and don't forget to like and subscribe. We'll see you again soon.